Hello, today I've got another very rare piece of English porcelain to show you. It was made at the Chelsea factory or the Chelsea porcelain factory in the middle of the 18th century. So between sort of 1743 and 1749. Now, how would we know this? Well, it's actually from the very rare first period where the wares were not marked with the anchors, which would come slightly later on. Uh, and some of the wares have actually got an incised triangle on the underneath. Now the pattern, it's the tea plant pattern and this is just a small little beaker, beautifully decorated. There's some little bugs on the inside. See the coloured bugs in there? They're hiding sort of little blemishes in the porcelain. And Chelsea tea pattern porcelain can be very expensive. Uh, a coffee pot, this sort of size, I'll put a picture of one up here, uh, can sell for sort of anywhere between sort of 10 and 50,000 pounds, depending on condition. Now, Chelsea's uh, quite sought after as the first English porcelain manufactory set up in this country, set up by a silversmith, Nicholas Spremont. And a lot of the early Chelsea porcelain, it has, it's very tactile, it's very uh, sculptural, it's more in line with pieces of silver of the time rather than line of uh, pieces of English porcelain that were made at the time. And it's very much collectible. So a beaker like this, worth sort of between a thousand and fifteen hundred pounds at auction. Quite popular, quite collectible and very rare. And again, completely unmarked like most English porcelain. So you have to know and you have to do your research and you have to have your reference books in order to identify it. There's lots more guides on my website, marklittler.com. And if you've got any questions about your own porcelain, please let me know and I'll be happy to help.